I was never a, a girly girl. I think femininity today is about practicality and reality. We're actually a, a studio of all women, which just kind of naturally happened. It's really empowering, actually, because being a woman designing for women, you think that a lot of women are part of the process, and that's actually the case in this building. This is the only room in the building which has four walls and a door, so it's quite private. This is my golden Irish potato. Because I'm Irish. This is my lucky money. I was very fortunate to grow up in his studio. It was my absolute favorite place to be. I don't do mood boards for a collection, but on this wall, I have things that are always inspiring me or that I'm connected to, like Louise Bourgeois and her big pink boobs which is so amazing because it's something very feminine, but they're hard and it's very sculptural. I love that contrast. When I'm in here, it's usually when I have my little sticker on the door, I'm like, do not disturb, um, which most people ignore. So this is our sample room where we do all our construction of the garments and all our pattern cutting. We're working on all our invitations for the show, but this season they're all stitched within the studio, so you can see the girls here are working on it now. And then inside here you can see doing handwork on the collections. I did one show, Eight Months Pregnant, so it was impossible for it not to really influence the collection. We did all these red drippy earrings, which were supposed to almost be like blood, and it was all very, very grotesque. <laughs> um, but yeah, but it's, it's a reality. I want to be very honest with what I do. I don't want to create a fantasy. You know, I want to tell a story and I want to create an emotion. I really love working alongside my mother. Um, she is kind of my partner and what I've really learned from her is her attention to detail. And that refinement and elegance is something that is so her and something that I love working with her on. I do feel that slip is very dark. True. Yeah. The fashion industry changes all the time. Whatever you do is always going to be going in or out of fashion at some point. I'm very lucky because I have grown up around it. I've seen the industry in so many different guises that it's given me the confidence to go, this is how I want to do it. <laughs> 